I'm Barbie the Welder, and this is how to weld a bowl. The materials you're going to need to make this project are washers and a little shop prop. And I'm using a nut for the shot prop that is half inch thick here and one inch wide here. The number of washers you're going to need to make your bowl is going to depend on how big your washers are. Mine are inch and three quarters, so I have 19 of them here. The way to know, and you can use different size washers, it's a little bit fun and artistic to see it that way. You can lay your bowl out flat to see what it's going to look like so that you know how many that you're going to need. To create the second layer, I'm going to take that nut and I'm going to rest it on the center of the bowl and then simply slide one of the washers up between the two, tack weld it here and here. And then I'll just slowly turn the bowl as I go and tack weld each one on. To create the final layer, simply do the same thing. Prop it up by the center, put your washer in place, and place one tack weld at, uh, at each spot. You can continue building your bowl up as tall as you want. I'm just going to make like a little fruit dish for the countertop, and so I'm going to leave it right here. Once you get it done, built up to the size you want it, just go ahead and take a wire brush and clean all your welds, and then you can clear coat it with a clear coat made for metal. I'm using my CP875 pneumatic die grinder to clean mine up. Did they teach you how to juggle in high school? It's, it's almost, it's almost like they knew I was going to be a clown when I grew up. <laughs> I'm in the process of creating exclusive metal art classes. Head over to my website and sign up today to be the first to know what's going on.